Well, hello again. This big fella right here, a 2215B, is going to get is getting the resuspension uh, treatment, and I've installed a new surround and a new spider, and the moving mass for the 2215 is supposed to be 97 grams. Well, this particular one, we start out with the cone, which is, you can see that, it says 80 grams. Then we subtract half of the weight of the surround and the spider, and the surround weighs 14 grams, the spider weighs 4 grams. So 14 and 4 is 18, so after that is 9. So how do we get to 97? Well, we'll subtract the 9 from the 80, and it's fluttering around between 80 and 81, so we'll call it 71. Oops, 71. 81, 71. One gram is not going to be a big deal, but it is very close. So we'll call it uh, we'll call it seventy one. There, it, there it goes. <laughs> Depends on how how hard I'm breathing. Uh, so we'll call it seventy one. We put the dome assembly on. One oh eight. Minus 9 is 97. Well, actually, no, it's, it would be 99. Uh, that is within 5%. Boy, I'm all over the place on this, aren't I? Anyway, I like to get within 5% of the moving mass, which this wasn't. This, this was actually about 15 grams light. So I think we'll call this a success. Install that assembly in there. It should be like new. This, these magnets, there's a pair of these. These were uh, torn down. Uh, full service cleaning, full service tear down cleaning and recharge. And they're at about uh, 9,000 gauss, which is where it should be. These are a bear to get apart because of that big old 0.6 inch uh, top plate. But they will be ready to uh, live again in some 4320 studio monitors. Along with that uh, pair of 2420s that I re-diaphragmed with Radian diaphragms uh, earlier. Alright, there you go. Out.